Hello guys, welcome back. Sometimes creating servers manually logging into the AWS management console and selecting all the options and then create EC tunes and it takes a lot of time to set up a server for your project. So today in this video tutorial we'll see how we can automate the server creation that is the EC2 instances using the launch template. So let's start. Log into your AWS management console and go to EC2. So under EC2, we'll find one option called launch templates. Okay, so click on this launch template. And you'll see here, I have already two templates created for that. So let me create one more template and I'll, I'll show you how you can create it and launch it. So just hit create launch template and just give a template name, what type of template it is. Uh, suppose I'll give like my demo template and give a version version of this template um, because when we modify again uh, based on your requirement it will create another version of this template so very, it is very important to provide the version information suppose I'll give as demo 1.1 and then the template tag the name of the templates will give us suppose name I'll give us demo template okay and the source template if you want to source any existing template you can select it as I'm going to create a fresh template I'm not going to select any template okay so you can see here two existing templates are there if you want to source you can use this option to source it next we have the contents of the templates what type of template you need and what type of instances you need to be created once you launch the template so you have to select the image ami so you can select the entire ami details over here you can find it out suppose i'll go with amazon linux 2 select it and then you have to go with instance type so what type of instance you want and I'll go with instance T2 micro, which is fit here. Select T2 right T2 micro and then key pair name. It's just um, if you have not exist any key pair, you can create the key pair here, create new key pair, and then what you'll do network settings. Okay, so you can select the virtual private cloud VPC. If you have already uh, created any network uh, VPC network, you can select it here. So I just selected uh, by default VPC and then select the group security group which is very important to access your server so to provide firewall access to your server. So just select whatever group you have created and provide a firewall access and then move on to the storage. So by default it takes the volume one as the root volume 8 GB of storage and volume type EBS general purpose SSD okay so if you want to add new volume just click on this add new volume and select what number of memory you need what is the device name everything you can put it here and add it so I don't need this extra volume so I'll just remove it and then next move on to the resource tags so you can just provide the resource tag or you can just leave it suppose if you want to put the name of this so if you want uh, template name right so um, put it like demo template and network interface so if you have already a network interface you can add it here add network interface and as we don't have any network interface i'm not adding it here and the advanced details here in the advanced detail section you will find the purchasing options of the EC2 instances like spot if you want to uh, purchase it in the spot you can select it here or the IM profile you can attach it here and set down be aware of the uh, EC2 instances and all you can select uh, once you set down the system it, it will, whether it will be stopped or terminated you can select it over here the next you can select the termination protection by default remember all the EC2 instances it will be off so if you want to select it you can enable it 
and similarly you can do other multiple things based on your requirement so once you select all the all over this what you have to do next just go ahead and hit in the create launch template so now you can see successfully created my demo template so now we created a template so let's move on to launch the template and see what is the instances getting created out of that so go to your launch template and select uh, the template which wants to launch suppose this is the mind demo template i want to launch it and just go here and launch instance from the template okay so you can set launch instance from template so it will ask you the versions which version you want so we have only one version so select the version so by default it is uh, demo 1.1 and the template name we have only one temp uh, three templates so select which template you want i've selected the demo template and the next number of instances if you need one or three or four or five you can select it here and then machine image just for a review it will give all the details type so we are okay with all these settings now next hit on the launch instance from template so as soon as you hit it it will say successfully initiated launch of instance just go and view instances okay so this is one so if you go our c2 dashboard we'll find one instance will come up now shortly so let's go to dashboard and see the instances running so not it no instances has come up yet so just wait for a few seconds and keep refreshing yeah we can see it here now our demo template this instances has now come up so if you go it here and see the options whatever we had added uh, so all the details about this so instance type amazon to emi this was used okay and if you want to go to the security you can see the security group what ssh tomcat http this is the security group which we had added so now you can see our instance and server is up and running we can able to connect this server using either ssh or http protocol hopefully you should have kept the key which you had provided in the template so just go to the server get the public ip here so i have kept my key safe so i can log into the server okay so so my key name is my pm file and as it is Amazon Linux machine, so the default user is C2 user at the red. Yes. See, now we are able to connect the server. So next time when we need new server to create it, so you don't have to go and create EC2 instances separately. What you have to do, you have to go to this launch template and select which template to use to create the instances select that and then just go to here and launch the instance from the template so that's all so it's a, how easy it is to launch instance immediately based on your requirement okay if there is an emergency you can directly uh, come here and execute this template to create instance for you and you see how quickly we can create an instance using this template hope you understood clearly how to set up the template and execute the template and create an instance out of that if you have any doubt or any concerns please do comment me in the comment section below i'll try to answer your questions if you have not subscribed my channel please do subscribe now so that i will get notified when i add new videos on my channel thank you